Mr. President, the South Center congratulates you and all WIPO member states for having successfully concluded this diplomatic conference. This treaty, the first of its kind, is an important event in the history of WIPO. The treaty denotes the conviction of all member states to create an enabling international legal framework to ensure that no one, in particular vulnerable populations, are excluded from participation in the knowledge society. Intellectual property rights should not be allowed to become a barrier to access to information and knowledge. Today, an important step was taken to respond to the needs of stakeholders in the copyright system other than right holders. The treaty establishes minimum terms for limitations and exceptions that should be put in place in national copyright law to eliminate some of the obstacles that persons who are blind, visually impaired, or print disabled face in getting access to books and other works in accessible formats. Member states may further implement in their national law other copyright limitations and exceptions. Developing countries and least developed countries should make full use of that discretion. The South Center stands ready to assist its member states and other developing countries and least developed countries in the implementation of the treaty. Finally, Mr. President, the South Center would like to thank His Majesty King Mohammed VI and the people of Morocco for their very warm hospitality and the excellent organization of this conference. Our thanks are also extended to the WIPO Secretariat and all conference staff. Thank you.